Today I'm going to be unboxing the free baby registry Walmart baby box. As I unbox everything, I will share my mother of three opinions on the items in the box, what I repurchased, what I didn't like, etc. And I will also quickly share how to get this box for free. But before we get into it, I have to shamelessly plug my channel. Please like and subscribe if you have not already. And if you are a current subscriber, thank you so much. I really do appreciate you guys. The first thing you need to do to get your free box is first create a Walmart baby registry. You don't have to fully deck it out. Just add a couple items in there and then copy your baby registry link. Then you'll need to click the link in my description below to get the free box. If you don't use my link in the description below, sometimes they try to charge you for this box, but click the link, paste in your baby registry information, put in your shipping address and everything, and then click complete, and you should get your free Walmart baby box within a week or two. Mine took me about two weeks to get. Now we'll go through what's in the box. First, we have these Huggies Special Delivery Diapers. These are kind of newer. Free of parabens, fragrance, elemental chlorine, I never used these. I always used Sam's Club or Costco diapers for the most part, but if you do really want Huggies or Pampers diapers, be sure to download the Target Circle app. Always make sure you stack coupons. There's tons of Huggies and Pampers coupons out there. You never have to pay full price. And then also, if you fall in love with either Pampers or Huggies, they have an app that you can put on your phone to get points for buying diapers, and then you can redeem those points for rewards. That's the first thing. Then we have, this is nice, a Zarbies Naturals Baby's Gripe Water. Ginger, fennel, chamomile, and lemon balm helps ease occasional gas and stomach discomfort for two weeks plus. This looks like a full size sample, which is really nice. I never specifically used this Zarbies brand gripe water, but I did try other gripe waters when my twins had colic. Their colic was so extreme, gripe water didn't do anything, but I do know plenty of moms who swear by gripe water, so this is a good sample. Next, we have this Evenflow Balance Pacifier. This is a nice free sample, and it looks like the shape of the pacifier is actually the shape that you want when you do look at getting pacifiers. The Philips brand is what was recommended in my nursing class because the shape of the nipple doesn't interfere with baby learning to latch. And this, the shape of this pacifier looks almost identical. So this is like a dupe of the Philips brand pacifier. Then we have another pacifier, the Tommy Tippy Nighttime Orthodontic Pacifier, age zero to six months. Proven to help babies sleep, recommended by 97% of moms. All right, good free sample. Next, we have another pacifier. This is like the pacifier baby box, I guess. It is the MAM Newborn Pacifier. This is actually the pacifier that my twins used for the brief period of time that they were taking pacifiers. The MAM brand is the one that they preferred. They ended up just not liking pacifiers pretty early on, which was fortunate for me because I know the pacifier habit can be a hard one to break for some kids. And at a certain point, your pediatric dentist is really going to urge you to break the habit because if they're still sucking on pacifiers or bottles past a certain point, it can affect their teeth as they're coming in. But obviously a lot of people use pacifiers. <laughs> So this is kind of the baby pacifier test box. Next, we have these little Highlands Baby medicines. Highlands Babies, it's kind of a homeopathic medicine. It's not traditional medicine like Tylenol or Advil, but a lot of moms use Highlands or homeopathic medicines to just use, I guess, like a more natural medicinal option for their babies because not everyone wants to give their babies like Tylenol 24 hours a day seven days a week when their baby's teething. So we have this oral pain relief daytime Highlands baby teething tablet, six quick dissolving tablets. And then we also have Highlands baby tiny cold tablets. So these are kind of a cool homeopathic medicine sample to keep in your medicine cabinet for when your baby starts teething or for when they get their first cold. But do note, do note for the cold tablets on the front, it says for six months plus. So don't give it to your baby if they have a cold prior to that. Next, we have this little envelope. 
it's these little milestone cards that you can use for just photographing the different milestones for your baby. All the way to 12 months, of course. Um, and then they also have some major milestone cards like I crawled today, I stood up today, and then fill in the blank. Then an advertising card for Palmer's cocoa butter cream, a little stroller and car seat buying guide. We have this Medela little advertising card. Definitely, I say this in all my videos, if you haven't already and you're past 29 weeks pregnant, be sure to get your free breast pump from insurance. Watch my free baby stuff video after this to get more details on that. Then we have this massage for stretch marks, Palmer's cocoa butter lotion. I use this a little here and there, just like the free samples that I got. I don't know if it necessarily helped or hurt. I still have plenty of stretch marks, but better than nothing. It at least relieves some of the itching during the major stretching phase in pregnancy. Then we have some Johnson's Cotton Touch. First is the Newborn Wash and Shampoo. I'm pretty sure this has fragrance in it. My family and kids can't use fragrance because they inherited my very sensitive skin that is eczema prone. 99% sure this has a scent to it. It does have a scent. I mean, it smells good, but it would make my babies break out. That is just something to think about when you're buying baby lotions and body washes and laundry detergents. For my family, knowing that I have sensitive skin, everything was free and clear, fragrance free. For detergents, shampoos, lotions, and body washes, everything fragrance free for my family. But this does smell good if you and your baby don't have skin sensitivities. But if you do notice early on that your baby's getting little red patches or skin conditions, move to the fragrance free. It'll, it should help. And then we just have this Cotton Touch body lotion, which I'm assuming has the same scent. I don't currently have a baby, so next time I do a big baby giveaway, I'm gonna throw all this in there for one of you mamas. Be sure to like and subscribe and follow me on Instagram to see when I do giveaways at my Zimmy. And then if you enjoyed this video, watch one of my other videos that should be floating over my face. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.